Chari. Ah, uh, Chari is a good ship to random in this map. Like probably, like amongst the strongest three or four for sure, right? I think Rus is the best though, simply because you can move the fishing boats around. Like if you couldn't do that, it would be very different. But as Rus, you can play pretty much only on one dock and still get fishing boats to up to three, four deep fish. Yeah, this map takes really long to load. I'm not too sure why. Mm. I don't destroy them. So let's try to kill some deer now, of course, I'm against the uh, watch. I've noticed deer more often than not spawn, or sometimes just spawns very into the course. Is that another deer oh. Okay, so I found both of them, that's kinda lucky. And even two wolves. Okay. So, uh, pretty much all the bounty uh, of the map is spawned, or of my side of the map is spawned here. It's kinda lucky, I guess, that I went to the left and not to the right. I'm gonna go for the deer pack first and then uh, for the wolves. I don't think he got both of his deer packs, right? Uh, he's already there with his scout. He either went to a scout, which is not impossible, but I, I wouldn't really expect... Oh, wow, this is really bad. No, 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 no. No, yeah, still. I messed up my macro there a bit. Quite a bit. I mean, there are a lot of wolves, right? This is not Boulder Bay. So even if you don't get deer, um, you can still age up here, I guess. Uh, should I just pull one villager? Because it's three, right? It's three wolves. So maybe I should. How many? One, two, three. That's really cool what he did there. Oh, did you see that? He has moved the ship over the wolves so I couldn't target. Oh, that's really nice. I will copy that in the future. Also, pulling villagers here is not bad, because I can simply place a dock, right? So four is good enough, I believe. Although, if they can move around, then you can go for more, for sure. Which is usually the case in this map. Like, I'm pretty sure my fishing boats can get to this spawn. I did, never found the deep fish there, though. Uh, He's gonna try to do the same. Uh, it's, it's impossible to click it. That's really cool. And I, what I'm surprised though is that I'm not stealing the ship. Not sure how that exactly works. Oh, can they actually not? No, they cannot. Oh. Okay. So he's already aging up. Um. 
I was really sure that they could move through there. Uh, that's a problem. I think I'm gonna need like a tower maybe in my gold. He goes for a knight, which I assume he will. What the fuck? Didn't I cancel that fishing boat? Yeah, six is really too much for a single pond. If they cannot move around, this is just bad. Yeah, they cannot. Ah, this is rare, actually. It can happen, of course. So my age up here is not too fast, but... I don't think that's a problem. Not too sure how many pawns does he actually have. I have to assume two or something like that, right? With this timing. And this, I guess you can go back. And these houses here are not the best. Uh. I mean, I, I can build a racks now, right? I'm no need to wait for for fuel or anything. Maybe uh, getting like 42 stone to get the upgrade would be a good idea. Uh, do I need a galley there? I don't think so, right? I can just send one spear. Uh, let's see what he's up to here. Like, I assume he's just getting a lot of pawns, right? I haven't seen a stable, but I haven't scouted that that well. Yeah, this is very heavy on wood, so. Oh, okay. So he did go for two scouts, right? That's interesting. Like I don't play like that on this map, but maybe, maybe it's a good thing to. No. And again, I think he's still going somewhat fast castle here. I think. Yeah, yeah I really overmade this, you know. So there are two relics there. Yeah, I can leave one on the dock and then rush the other one. Right. Like, 
leave one on the dog, get the other one. I'm fine with that one back home. I wish I had more gold. Uh, this is wrong. Where he's going? No, oh, I've just left with more of my spearmen. Don't do this. I really wish I had my spearman here. Ah. I'm gonna have two knights, I guess. Oh, so he's actually making archers. I think I'm happy to see that. How many? Scholars, uh, what am I doing? Why? So let's back. For sure. Let's wait for my entire army and also let the militia expire, right? Let's get a market. I guess I needed like a blacksmith right this game, probably. Does he have a spearman or yeah he does have a spearman. So this is actually some kind of feel uh, intensive play to say the least. Can I try to catch reinforcements with knights? Ah, I just made too many scholars. I used the emergency repairs a bit too quickly. You know. I wonder whether he's on one TC or two. I think I should get like this one. I should have gotten this one a while ago. Mm, there's a chance he's just uh, done with this and transitioning. I do have a 
Very bad, though. Right. It's just not a great thing to play against. I could have won that one. I mean, if I can get a fight now, I think I should go for it, right? Um, I have full Castle H army. He's still feudal. Or at the very least, push so I can get the relics. I wish I had my upgrades though before I did this. I think I really need to stop making nights now. I mean, if it's Fiodor against Kasserich, I just cannot run into Spearman like this, I guess. Mm, yeah, not perfect. I don't think it was as bad as maybe it looked. But I think I need to go into something else now. Question is what, right? Like he's gonna go into cross on me now, so maybe. Maybe I should have just played more defensively and well, and just go castle it, like defend with towers or whatever. And Ah, uh, Imperial, it's not Castle, it's not going Castle. Maybe I can still do that, but I would need to get walls, right? Did I create a mango or not? Doesn't look like it. How many farms? Like 20? It's not bad, right? And I have 4 relics, so I really think... I just need to make sure I don't die and, and get to Imperial, right? I think that should be the, the correct play. Probably could have done this earlier, but I think I'm still in time to play like this, I, I would think. Archer Spearman. Yeah. Okay. I could be gathering. Then I have like five on gold here. Did I get this up right? I didn't. I'm really not sure if I can survive a, an attack if he just goes for it. 
Maybe, maybe I can, maybe. Yeah, I don't know. I guess I will find out very soon. Ah, this is going to happen faster. Yeah? Mm -hmm. It doesn't look like he has siege, right? So maybe now he has to wait for spring. That's, and that gives me enough time to get like a couple of cannon towers or something like that, maybe. Ah, he's going with the ramps, okay. I guess I need to move the the relic to this one, right? Uh, cannot be wrong. I'm probably to this one as well. I'm losing villagers right now. Ah, textiles, textiles, textiles. Ah. Don't tell me I'm losing my seats like this. I think this is not looking great for me. I think this engage was like if I just engage here, I think I'm perfectly fine. I just engage it in, in a very random location there, and maybe I can still survive. I don't think I have a couple cannon towers, right? And Swabia, so maybe this is still not over, but could have been so much better for me if I just uh, took the proper engage there. So I'm still alive and with 70 villagers, 4 relics uh, and more like the fact that he's still going for it is uh, a bit relieving for me because I don't think he can break me anymore. Uh, it would be more scary if he just uh, boomed behind this, I think. I think. Twist or not? <laughs> Is he going for it or not? I'm not sure anymore. Maybe he, he's realized he cannot really break me anymore, right? And he's just gonna go Imperial and so on. Like, he should be ahead in villagers. I think that's... Uh, that's granted at this point. How far ahead? I don't know. I assume he's on 2TC. I gotta be careful with the... Uh, secret side victory, I guess. Probably gonna keep here, right? So my food is more or less safe. Maybe even slightly more forward to get the gold would have been better, but don't want to be too greedy here and just die. Oh, 
Okay, so he is really going for it. Ah, uh, is this not in... It's not connected. Oh, fuck. Did I lose my cool burning? Ah, uh, looks like I did, right? Yeah. I will need more stone because I want to get a keep here in the middle so that when I chop through I actually have a keep there, right? I have a lot of um, wood. I, I feel like I built too many things uh, around my my chapel. I, I would like to have more farms there, but this works. Ostia. It's actually sad, but I'm not killing it. I dig up the side, right, which is the most important thing there. Really. So I'm not sure if I can actually attack. Um, I feel like if he gets a a fight in a in an open, he can just kill my seeds, right? Maybe I'm wrong, I'm not sure. No, 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 no. So eventually he did get that switch, right? Maybe I should be making horsemen, uh, something like that. Right? This is still castle age, so I just don't know if I need to, to make something happen now or this is just still fine for me. Oh oh. And also I never I made a university now that I think about it. Um, no, I don't know if that's the most important thing in this game, but... Like, my units are still, like, elite, right? So maybe this is not bad. Although giving away cool burdens is not never good. And if, if, I, if I only lose like one, uh, both will die. It wasn't cheap for him though. It really wasn't cheap. What?
Again, I think this was really unnecessary from me. Uh, maybe it's not bad, though. It's still Kassarid, right? That's very relieving to see. So. I don't think killing villagers there is worth it for him, right? When I'm... I have Swabia, right? Like, losing villagers is... Uh, nothing too impactful for me. Yeah, my economy here is just not properly balanced, right? Did I kill the Springles? I'll kill it. He can very easily transition into Spearman, he has the Raxus already. I wonder if he has any, any more gold besides this one. Um, may maybe he does not have access. <gasps> I never even saw that one. Oh, is that the HR? Yes, it is. Oh, yeah. That's a very interesting location. I'm like five seconds too late here to actually uh, prevent it from happening. But maybe it will still be fine in like, the grand scheme of things. Where's my bomb? Like I just really don't want him to mass uh, ramps now. I think that could make the game very unpleasant for me. And I gotta remember about the secret side victory. Yeah, cool one. Cool one. I feel like being able to uh, put the relics in. In docks really makes uh, things really quick for you in terms of how fast your economy booms, right? Um, does Rus have a chance versus HR in late game? Yeah, I think in general I would say Rus is stronger than HR in late game with the rams and the. How are these guys called? Uh, Strelzi, but he just was quite far, uh, far behind, right? And I had four relics, right? So then it's not as easy. But in general, I would give the edge to Rusin. So yeah, this is closer than I expected. Like I expected to be even farther ahead than this. Then why was his Imperial Age so late? So it was always one TC, okay. Hmm. And how many pawns? I mean, I guess all of them, right? Yeah, see this keep moving around, like here. Never got this one. 